Hey everybody, it's Matt with Roller Weight Loss. I'm one of the dietitians here. Just gonna go over some quick tips for you for your grocery shopping. Give you some ideas for things that you can keep in mind whenever you're walking through the store. Number one, always take a list. Make sure that you have a list with you that you stick to. You don't add stuff to it uh, randomly or impulsively. Make that list something that's based off of a plan that you've set forward for the week, for meals that you're gonna have, for snacks that you have so that you don't randomly amass this bunch of food at home that you're never gonna use because they're just, oh, I might make this meal at this time, but you haven't actually planned to do it. When you're in the grocery store, try to stick to the exterior of the grocery store. This means sticking with fresh meats, fresh vegetables. If you wanna venture into the frozen section, do some frozen vegetables, frozen meats, you can do that, but make sure that you're doing fresh frozen meats and vegetables. We don't wanna do vegetables or meats that have a lot of sauces, uh, or calories added to them. Certainly don't wanna do a lot of meats that have breading or batter added to them or anything like that because those are gonna add calories and add fat. Keep those things in mind, kinda keep it pretty basic. That will make up the majority of your meals sticking to the exterior of the store. The rest of it is just avoiding the impulse buys. Avoid the snacks, avoid the, the stuff when you're checking out, all that stuff can kinda sneak into the cart sometimes. I would say another thing to look out for too is the habits that you've developed over the decades that you've been shopping in the past, there's going to be a point in the store that you just naturally gravitate towards. Stay away. Like if you know that you usually go to the soda section, you don't have any business doing soda right now. Don't even go to that section of the store. You don't need to be there, okay? So try to think about where you're going to go in the store and where you're not going to go in the store. With everything crazy going on right now, especially meal planning is that much more important. Um, if you want to plan out your meals for one or two weeks at a time, and then try to use um, aspects or, or ingredients from one meal, uh, try to pick out an ingredient that you can use for three or four different meals so that you don't have to purchase a lot of different things. So if you wanted to buy a big bag of frozen chicken, you can use that for four or five different meals. If you buy a big bag of frozen broccoli, that can work for a bunch of different meals. So um, try to work a couple weeks at a time to limit the amount of time that you actually have to spend in the grocery store. I know I went the other day and I had to wear a mask because my wife made me. Um, just be careful when you're out there. Try to limit your visits as much as possible. Um, and that planning really will help with that because it will allow you to get everything that you need in one swoop and not have to worry about making repeat trips. Y'all stay safe. Have a great day. We'll talk to you later.